what's up good people no this is not an episode of porn it is going to be a pretty long rambling and ranting video so if you guys do not want to sit through this video please go ahead uh, go watch another video or turn this window off or close this window I mean turn this window off the hell am I talking about anyways a couple of days ago I actually posted as a bulletin on my channel stating that I would like to make a public service announcement for you guys especially all the nerfers to beware of a particular user on eBay that goes by the username of that sports card guy now this incident didn't happen to me directly, it happened to a good friend of mine and most of you know him, he's Atani. And um, well, in Pwned episode 4, all right, Pokemon 4GS actually asked me uh, in the comment why I did not include this uh, announcement thingy that I wanted to make in the video. Now whatever happened, this particular situation I feel is so important that it deserves a separate video on its own, therefore I did not want to put it with a Pwned episode. So this is what happened. Atani was actually bidding on a lot that was listed on eBay by this particular user, that sports card guy. And in this particular lot, there were a bunch of crappy blasters like the Deploy, Tommy 20, some not so crappy blasters like a Tech Target and a Long Strike. Now the coolest blaster in that whole lot was a PAS, Pump Action Shotgun or PAS. Some of you might call it different names. So therefore Atani decided to go ahead and bid on this listing and he won. So, some of you guys overseas, especially in America, uh, you guys don't offer shipping overseas and we respect that. So, we actually have uh, an address in America that does or provides us a forwarding service. So, you guys will actually ship your item from your place over to this address in America and they will ship it over to us. That also translates to double times the shipping for us over here in Singapore. That's why a lot of us like to ask you, do you ship internationally, do you ship to Singapore, how much would shipping cost if you ship directly to us, alright? So, another problem with this particular mode of shipment is that we are not able to check the contents of the items or to see the condition of the items until it gets all the way here in Singapore. So, Atani received the item and to his dismay, when he opened it up, there was no pass in this lot. The PAS was missing. So, he went back to the eBay listing and checked to see if it was incorrect and well the listing still stated or is still there in the picture that there was a pass in the lot so of course his instincts were to go and contact the seller so he contacted this guy that sports card guy and asked him what was going on so the sports card guy replied and said that he actually tried to contact Atani via email but he didn't receive um, a reply from Atani he said that he wasn't able to ship the pass out and so he was going to swap it with another blaster and indeed he did but guess what the blaster was it was a busby double shot now if you guys know where i'm going of course you would not want a busby double shot for pass nobody would be stupid enough to make that exchange so atani said no i want this particular blaster in the first place i bid on your lot specifically for that one black colored blaster with a brown stock and a long orange barrel that fired balls and I won that blaster I would appreciate it if you could ship it over to me so the seller said no I'm not able to ship it to you because this blaster was too big to fit into the box now, it's too long and therefore if I were to put it in or include it with the shipment I wouldn't be able to ship the item out to you that was a lie I mean we guys are not dumb you know Atani actually went to measure the length of the pass and compare it to the length of the Busby double shot and a double shot is actually longer than a pass so this guy I mean come on he has an integrity issue alright so Atani said look I want this blaster so this guy said alright what I can offer you is very simply ship all the items back to me and I'll give you a refund for the items now this doesn't make sense to us because that means that we have to ship it from Singapore all the way back to America we already have paid double shipping from your place to our forwarding address from our forwarding address to us and now you want us to ship it back to you just for a refund that's not fair to us either all right so to cut a long story short I know that they came to some kind of an agreement but I just want to bring uh, this point forward to all of you uh, my viewers please be careful when you buy stuff off eBay eBay generally is rather safe but you guys really have to be careful when a seller does not deliver uh, or doesn't deliver what he or she promised you guys have rights that you can exercise make sure you exercise it now sellers on eBay please uh, keep to your promises please make sure that you state everything very clearly and make sure that your picture 
and your description matches what you're going to send out. Alright, it's not very nice for you to do such a thing. Okay, so you guys just be careful. Now before I end this video, I want to make a quick announcement for you guys, uh, to you guys. At the end of this week, yes, I will be uploading episode 5 of Pwned, but please pardon me, the next week, the following week, I will be very, very busy because I'm actually involved with the Big Groove 2012. Uh, it's been a long time since I performed at the Big Groove and I'm really, really excited to be a part of this year's Big Groove. So I hope that you guys in Singapore, if you guys are interested in dance event, please go check it out. I'll provide the link to the Big Groove site somewhere here or in the video description. Alright, so um, it's going to be a week filled with a lot of rehearsals, a lot of date nights, um, a lot of learning steps and everything, getting myself prepped up, hyped up for the show. So I hope that you guys pardon me. I'm sorry, I apologize in advance for not being able to release a Pwned Episode 6 as, uh, you know, like, as normal as usual for a week so uh, I'll try my very best to keep it to maximum just a week stay tuned for this weekend's pwned thanks for watching guys and yeah once again please be careful when you buy stuff off eBay take care peace